visionaries change our world. Their unbridled imagination shapes tomorrow. And their legacy is our today. He always knew, and he was always so sure of where Rodeo Drive was heading. Most people wouldn't recognize Rodeo Drive if they snapped back to the 60s because it was really just a very simple street. There was a gas station, there was uh, restaurants. It had nothing like it has today or very little like it has today. He had such a vision for what he thought it should be. Uh, and he really worked hard towards crafting it and making it into that vision. He's very creative, he was very innovative, uh, he always thought out of the box. He had a natural sense for what people wanted, what would keep them attracted, what would keep them in a, in a mood to do something. People would come into the store, they just were intrigued, they wanted to hang out. The bar, I think, was a great idea. Uh, the pool table was another great idea. There was also the, the fireplace with the autograph wall uh, and the wall of stars there. In the 60s and the 70s, the street wasn't as busy, and so you would regularly walk down the street and you would see celebrities all over the place. Every single star you could possibly imagine came into that store and at least once, and a lot of them were there quite often. Fred Heyman's legacy is more than just a street. His legacy is really, I think, he loved his family, he loved his kids. He loved the community in general. He loved giving back. He was making things better uh, for the better good. But he definitely was a visionary.